Welcome to Realtors Denim Styles. We're down to the Union Market outside Union Station. You can sit down here. You can have a pint to start your dinner. Then you can grab dinner. Then you can grab dessert. They've got it all for you and even have a nightcap. Uh, it's going to be going on until 9 o'clock tonight with tunes and food and a couple of beers. Again, right outside Union Station. Perfect evening for it. Now tomorrow, pretty nice day shaping up. We may see another round of scattered pop-up afternoon showers. A lot of that due to the lake breeze and the lake breeze convergence that we're seeing. That's what's firing up those showers out toward Cambridge right now. We had a few across North York that extended back in through Mississauga, Brampton, and then out toward Milton. A few more of those lingering showers are still across southwestern Ontario. So. We'll be dealing with that again as we head into the day tomorrow. Uh, a little unsettled as far as the general pattern is concerned. You can pretty much see everything is sort of moving off in this direction uh, for the most part. So what we're going to do on Wednesday, really Wednesday morning, we're going to get around to showers coming through and a risk of an isolated thunderstorm. Some of this moisture, not that, mo uh, sorry, one second, not uh, that moisture, but some of this moisture right over here is going to come moving into the area. So uh, we'll be keeping an eye on this for the potential of some thunderstorm development Wednesday on and off wet weather expected. You'll see it here on the future cast sneaking up from the south. Moves in tomorrow with the Lake Breeze boundary. Again, that's going to be this line right here that fires up with that potential for showers and storms. Uh, and then we'll watch that next wave come rolling through as we get into Wednesday morning. A little bit more unsettled, a little bit more thunderstorm chance there during the day. Uh, 18 degrees is what we're looking at to start things off. Cloudy may see a brief shower in the morning or a pocket of drizzle or two as we head in through midday, mainly cloudy. The city of Toronto, for the most part, should stay dry with the exception of the north end into the afternoon as we have that potential of isolated showers and thunderstorms along the lake breeze. A high of 26 in the forecast, feeling like 31. When you take a look at the seven day forecast, the next couple of days will be into the mid 20s and then we'll warm things back up as we head into Thursday. We're looking at a high of 28 degrees. Another round of scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms possible on Friday. And then as we get into the weekend, and it is a long weekend coming our way, we'll be up to about 30 degrees. Sunny skies expected both Saturday and Sunday. Once we get into Monday, though, the possibility of showers and storms in the forecast there for us. So heating up, getting a little bit warmer, and those humidex values will be into the upper 30s. So uh, pop by Union all summer long. They're here until 9 o'clock most evenings. Have to check on your forecast. I'll have an updated one tonight at 11.